another book I'd like to talk to you about is my own book, which is Music is the Key, uh, which you can see here. And I wrote this many years ago, um, I suppose as a result of, I was seeing so many children uh, using the lift, using the sound therapy, and seeing the changes that it was making, not just to one child, but actually to every child. And that was what made me realize that I had to write about it. Um, and of course, the natural thing was to come and see Paul and talk to Paul um, and see what he felt about me writing it and any ideas that he may have. And you were so encouraging at that time in terms of moving forward and writing the book. And I suppose the reason I'd love parents to have a look at it is that any parents who've looked at it in the past have said, golly, you know, in the chapters, because each chapter is represented by a child who presents in a certain way. So whether it's a child on the spectrum, whether it's a child with auditory processing disorder or dyspraxia or whatever it is, each chapter is represented by a child who I would describe as the key holder child, who, who represents lots of children who present in a similar way and what we did and what we do and how that that really helps the child achieve their greatest potential. So that's worth having a look at as well. Good book.